developing story this time across our borders. And the coup leader in Burkina Faso has said he is ready to hand over power to transitional civilian authorities. General Gilbert Diendere, who led last Thursday's coup by the presidential guard, has also apologized to the nation. In a statement late on Monday, General Diendere said he was committed to handing over power to civil authorities based on the proposals of regional mediators. He also said he was prepared to release abducted Prime Minister Yakuba Isaac Zida. The general also apologized to the nation and the international community. General Diendere's whereabouts are unknown and there have been reports that he has taken refuge in the home of a traditional leader. At least 10 people have been killed and more than 100 injured in clashes since Thursday. Groups of youths were already putting up barricades and burning tires in the outlying Ouagadougou districts, criticizing ECOWAS as well as shouting slogans hostile to the presidential guard and its commander. The soldiers staged the coup ahead of the elections planned for October 11, angry at the transitional regime's ban on any candidate who had supported Compaore in his bid to extend his 27-year rule before he was ousted by a popular uprising at the end of 2014. Michelle Ngele, KTN News.